Hello beautiful and welcome to today's video. In today's video we are going to see if this new kit from Sephora it is a must-have or it is something revolutionary that we need to pay a little bit more attention to. This is a Sephora favorites kit. It says it's fresh face refresh a kit with trendy glowy products to create a full face effortless no makeup makeup look this kit includes four full size and five deluxe products to create the perfect fresh face look i usually do not uh put makeup on without foundation so this is definitely gonna be interesting to see how i'm gonna feel about it usually i feel like i need foundation but this is how the bag looks like mm, it's okay ish right it has some uh, paper thing inside so let's start with first things first with this rare beauty um always an optimistic illuminating primer so i guess we're just gonna apply this one all over the face oh it has a pump okay i have not tried anything from rare beauty yet so this is definitely gonna be my first product this is supposed to be like more of a five minutes makeup no makeup look and uh I mean, I'm into that. If it only takes five minutes and it's going to look amazing for those days when I'm in a rush. Or I think this one for beginners, especially those people that find it really hard to use a foundation. This might be something really nice and interesting to look into. Now, this primer looks really nice. I like the way it looks. I like the way it feels. It's a, it's a little bit tacky, but I feel like it makes my uh, pores look a little bit nicer and because of all that nice glowiness to it. Next in here, I'm going to go with this Iconic London uh, Sheer Bronzer. And I'm just going to see... Oh, this one has a squeezy tube. So I'm going to put this one right here. I'm not sure if we need to have a brush with this one. I'm not sure. So I'm just going to add a little bit in this area. Now, it's only one color, so that could be a little bit difficult for some people. But considering that they're saying this is a sheer one, it might work nice for a lot of skin tones. But definitely, I don't, I'm not sure if it's going to go well for deeper skin tones. I'm going to add a little bit on my nose just to kind of, you know, give that illusion. And I'm going to take a brush and I'm going to go with a brush and see how that's going to go. All right, so it's definitely sheer, but it's not too bad. I actually still can see just a little bit. Like, look on this side, right? I like that. That's not too bad at all. What do you think? I like it. I like it. Not bad. Next, we're going to go with the uh, blush. This is from Tarte and is Breezy Cream Blush in Peach Sunset. A very nice color. I'm gonna go and take a brush and just kind of apply nicely. I'm gonna go a little bit more with the blush because that's basically the only thing that is actually gonna show up on our face today. But it's a very nice uh, natural color. There you go. So next thing here, we do have this Patrick Ta dual little thing. I really need to see how this is going to look like. I'm honestly uh, nervous because I don't think my uh, brows are uh, good for this. All right, so I finally was able to open it. I was not sure how to, but I'm going to make this on the side like that. I'm going to go in here. And just kind of coat this really nice. And I'm going to go on my hand. Just kind of move some product around. You really have to go in here. Okay. 
All right, so let's see. I'm not sure my brows are the ones that are good for this. Yeah, definitely not my thing. Um, it's definitely not for brows like mine. It's definitely for some that have uh, full brows, not sparse brows like I do. So I'm just going to get in there just a little bit. And then I'm definitely going to use some of my own products to just kind of cover a few things here and there after we're done with this look. Now, next in here, um, I have a few lip lip and eye product so why don't we go with this benefit um eyeliner which is in brown there we go and then the mascara i already had this mascara but i'm gonna open it so i can show you how it performs um when i had it i it was okay-ish. It's not too bad, but it's more like it's very, very similar to Too Faced uh, Better Than Sex Mascara, but I feel like that mascara is a little bit better. And then we have a lip oil from Ilia, and this is in Tahiti. This is a nice color, actually. very natural and then at the end we have a the reason why I bought this <laughs> it's a uh, airbrush flawless setting spray from Charlotte Tilbury voila this is the makeup that I came out with using just items from this bag now this is very very natural beautiful glowy this is summery yeah it's pretty nice i mean i can't say this is a bad um, makeup look or a bad look to say but this is definitely not something that i would personally go for um, but if you're somebody that likes this type of look, then by all means, go ahead and purchase this. But I have to say, even just purchasing this, I think discovering three uh, products that I kind of think are going to be really nice in my makeup routine. I mean, even the Rare Beauty one I did like, even this lip oil is really, is feeling really nice on the lips. I think that is pretty nice and the price is really really good now i'm gonna show you what else i would do definitely i would put uh some more products in my uh brows because they're not looking great right now so i'm gonna go in with my uh nyx brow tint pen and i'm gonna use the one in uh, espresso And I just went in for a little bit when where I have like gaps into my brows. And one last thing that I would do, I would just try to cover my under eyes a little bit. So I'm going to go with this Fenty Beauty uh, Bright Fix Eye Brightener in Deep Butter. And I also go in a little bit in areas where I have like some red spots that I do not want to show um, like around here and then I'm going to go a little bit under my nose right here. So I think it's a really nice kit to put together uh, by Sephora. It's nice and easy to use, very, very straightforward. But definitely I feel like you need a foundation or something else to put underneath it and some concealer to be able to actually accomplish like a more of a, what I consider a natural look or a full complete look, right? Um, but this is all I have for you today. Thank you so, so much for being here. I do want to announce the winner. 
of this giveaway. You're going to find the winner in the uh, description box right there because um, I need to look a little bit more into it. But and the new giveaway is going to start a little bit later. I'm going to give you all the information in the description bar right there. But this is all I have for you today. Thank you so, so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I will see you all uh, next time. Bye now. Thank you.